exams during online classes? Should we have them or should we not? Should schools conduct assessments for all grades as part of their online classes, some of their grades or none at all? What is the point in having exams except for additional stress during this pandemic? Every parent is thinking about these questions now. For one minute, let us all forget about our current understanding of what an exam or an assessment is. Just for a minute, forget about it. Let me ask you a question now. How useful is a car without its braking system? A car without brakes. Is there any point in a car just speeding along without being able to slow down or even stop when needed? It is actually quite useless. Now let's look at assessments in the same light. Online education is a new model that we're all forced to adopt this year and we really don't know how effective it is being. So should we not stop and check if online education is in fact reaching the children? Should we not stop and check where the teaching methods are working? We definitely should. Assessments serve as a tool to help slow down the online learning process, to pause and to look at what is working and what is not and to take remedial action to make it work. They are as important as the brakes in your car when used correctly. And these assessments, mind you, should not be like the usual ones that we have at a regular school. These are not for the parents to sit and teach their children, prepare them for the exam, no. These definitely should not be used to rank the children in a class. Assessments are for the teacher as much as it is for the students. It is a powerful tool to check the effectiveness of the teaching methods being employed online. It can be as simple as a set of multiple choice questions online, but it can show you which topics are understood by the children and which are not. And based on the results seen, we can course correct. Lessons can be taken again by teachers, perhaps using different techniques to reach children. Older students can definitely identify the areas that they've not yet understood and get help from teachers. Separate classes can be taken for children who need them. So yes, as much as a car needs its braking system, assessments when used correctly is an essential tool to check the effectiveness of online teaching and to make it effective.